Hi there. So you are here because you purchased this microphone from Amazon and you don't know how to use it or it's not working out for you. So in this video, I'm going to cover these topics. How to make this microphone work with your laptop, mobile, tablet, PC, DSLR, etc. Okay. Number second, what to do if it is recording too much background noise. Number third, if you have a custom query, if you have a question which I haven't answered in this video, then I'm going to tell you the solution for that. But for that, you need to watch the complete video. Don't skip it in the middle. If you want to know the solution, if you want to record high quality audio, you need to watch this complete video. Okay, so first of all, I would like to begin this help video by saying that this microphone right there is not defected. Most of the people return this microphone thinking that it is defective and it is not working for their mobile. It is not working for their mobile. It is true. But the chances that it is defective is next to nil. This microphone is made in such a way that it cannot be defective. Okay, in 99.999% of the cases, you won't receive a defective piece. The chances are that you are having compatibility issues with your microphone and with your device. Okay, so with this microphone, you must have got this microphone splitter cable. And there are actually three configurations, three ways using which you can make this microphone work on your mobile, laptop, tablet, PC, etc. Okay, anything. But in this video, I'm just going to use this mobile. Okay, I'm going to make this microphone support on this mobile. All right, so this microphone splitter cable has two jacks, one for the headphone, one for the microphone, but there are actually three configurations for it. Okay, so first of all, how do you find out that if this microphone is working for your device or not? Okay, so what I will do is that I will connect it in three different ways. The first way, which I can guarantee you will not work in 90% of the cases is to connect for some, it might work, but in 90% of the cases, it doesn't work. It doesn't work this way. That's why I provided this cable. So first of all, you connect this microphone directly to the 3.5 mm port. Okay. And now, how do we actually know? How do we actually know that the microphone is recording? That this microphone, external microphone is recording. As you can see in this mobile, as I speak, there are graphs. And when I don't speak, there are no peaks. Okay. So if I tap on this microphone in silence, then there should be the spiky graphs. Right? So let's see if there are spiky graphs or not when I tap on this microphone. So as you can see, there are no graphs when I tap on this microphone. This shows that the mobile is still recording from its internal microphone and not the external microphone. How? How do you know that? Well, if I tap on this area, which is the microphone in silence, then you will see the graphs. All right, so you can see the graphs as I tap on it. This is a direct indication which shows that using this meta method, the microphone is not working with this mobile. Okay, so now let's move on to the second configuration, which I'm sure will work, will work in 80% of the cases. Okay, so what is the second configuration? Well, in the second configuration, you connect this microphone first to the microphone jack of the splitter cable and then you connect the splitter cable to this mobile. Well, I'm telling you in advance for this mobile, even this method doesn't work, but the third method will. Okay. So let's see, I'm going to connect this microphone splitter cable like this. 
for most of you this method will work okay for most of you but let's check it again is it working using this method how do i know that i'm going to tap this microphone So as you can see that even this method doesn't work for this mobile. For most of you, this method is the way to go. This method will work for most of you. Well, if even this method didn't work out for you, then we need to move on to the third configuration. But for the third configuration, you will need earphones. All right, so this is the third method. And in this method, I'm going to use these earphones. Now you may be thinking, what help will this earphones do? Okay, well, don't worry about that for now. I'm just going to connect these earphones to this green jack. Okay, done. So the configuration now looks like this. I have the microphone connected to the red jack and the earphones connected to the green jack. Pretty simple, right? So now this method will work. So I'm going to connect this splitter cable to the mobile. And now let's tap on it in silence and see if it will work or not. Look at the red area. Okay, look at the red area you can see that the spikes have gone up considerably because this microphone is more sensitive than the internal and than this internal microphone of this mobile okay so as you can see that this third configuration is working for us here is the silence Okay, so this mobile supports this third configuration. And these are all the three configurations which you can use to make this microphone work on your device. So I showed all the three configurations for this mobile. But now what will you do if you have a laptop, tablet, PC or whatever? Okay, well for that, you need to try the third configuration because in laptop, the laptop actually doesn't laptop or pc laptop or pc doesn't actually recognize this microphone as an external microphone so for that you need to try the third configuration what is that just connect the connect this microphone to the red jack and connect the earphones to the green jack okay and the third configuration should do will you also have to tinker around in the software settings okay go to the sound settings and see which device is working for you which device is not working for you okay just play around with it i can't tell you a simple generic solution which will apply to all of your situations because every laptop is different everyone has a different type of sound card everything will be different so there is no fixed method of making it support to your laptop but believe me it will support your laptop just play around with it and see what you can do. Okay, so now let's move on to the second problem. The second problem which most of the people face is that the microphone records too much background noise. Okay, the background noise goes like shh. Okay, this is the type of background noise that people generally tend to get. So what can you do to avoid that? Well, first of all, let me clear a biggest misconception that people have. They think that if the microphone is recording too much background noise, that it is a problem of the microphone. Well, guess what? It's the exact opposite. It's not the problem of the microphone. It's the problem of the device that you are using to record it. This microphone enhances the device the recording capabilities of your mobile but guess what if the recording capabilities of your mobile is not good then this microphone won't do much good so 
The first solution is if you have a different device, if you have a higher end mobile, okay, like uh, some higher end models of Samsung or some expensive mobile, then use that. If you have that, then use that. Don't go for, you know, the lower budget uh, um, mobiles because in them, you tend to get generally lower audio quality and too much background noise is actually there. The second thing you can do, you can do and you should do this thing is while recording, turn off the fans. Okay, I know it's somewhere out there. I know it's too much heat, but just turn off the fans and close the windows and make sure that no external noise is there. Okay, because this external noise contributes to the background noise that you will get in your videos. So make sure that you record in absolute silence. The third solution and the last solution but one of the best solutions for too much background noise is to use a software called Audacity. Okay, Audacity is actually a type of software which you can use to clear out the background noise. Not only that, you can also use it to make your voice sound better. So, so the chances are that I haven't solved your query yet you are facing a problem which I haven't answered in this video. Well, you will see my contact number on the screen right now. And if you are facing a problem, please give me a WhatsApp uh, this number and I will help you. I will reply you within two or three hours and we will surely find a solution together. Believe me, this microphone is very good. For this budget, it is one of the best microphone that you can use. If you are facing any problem, just WhatsApp me at the contact number that you can see on the screen and we will find a solution together. So thank you so much guys for watching.